Okay, guys, so it is Thursday, March 21st. Um, I'm feeling better than I did yesterday. I clearly still don't have, like, a voice or anything. I'm not going to, there's no chance in hell I'm going to make it through practice to practice. I've kind of just decided that, but I'm going to go to school. I have just show choir today, so it should be slightly, I know it's going to be hard because like any physical activity makes me cough. Um, and saying we're basically doing dancing the entire time, it's going to be a little rough. Um, like I said, I'm, I've already made up my mind I'm not going to practice um, just because even like walking is like hard to breathe so I'm like after dancing and then like then running around is not no um yesterday we won our game when I mean we I mean the team because I didn't go um apparently something happened to one of my teammates because they're like um prayers for Natalie like um when the videos of someone making a shot is like do this for Nat um I was like I hope you're okay Nat and Natalie's like I'm gonna make, keep you guys updated I'm just sitting there last night I'm like what the hell happened? I'm like nervous. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get water and then probably get ready to leave soon. Um, yeah, so um, my lacrosse bag and my lacrosse stick are still in my car. Thankfully, I'm gonna grab my inhaler and just probably take it before I go into school because I feel like that will at least help me last a little bit longer. Um, so yeah, we got today and tomorrow, and then it's spring break. Thank fucking God. Um, so yeah, I doubt I'll go to practice today. I might try to go to practice tomorrow, but we will see. Um, yeah, I've kind of taken it slow this morning and I've been flopping between going to school or not, but I know my dad really wants me to go to school, and I'm feeling better than I did yesterday. Um, is just kind of this cough in my throat so you know what i have not taken this morning day quill i will take some day quill yesterday i took some and i don't think it really did much but i haven't taken any today so i'll take some as i'm staring down the day quill bottle um but yeah i'm just gonna get some water and then my inhaler is in my car because it's in my lacrosse bag and i'll take some day quill and yeah, that's quite a bit. Um, got 30 more pages in my book. Um, so I'm excited. It's a little weird. I don't really read novels, and this is a no and the book I'm reading is a novel. So I'm like, yeah. It's, I mean, I enjoyed, I'm enjoying the book, but at the same time, like, I love my murder mystery books. I love my mystery books. Um, I love my romance novels. Well, I love my romance books. I mean, this is, like, kind of a romance book, but, like, not really. Um, so, yeah, I'm kind of excited just to finish it so I can start a new true crimey mystery book. Um, so, yeah, but I'm going to get water, take some Dayquil, and then probably head out pretty soon. It's 1026. I need to leave by 1104. Um, so yeah, wish me luck because I have a very bad feeling that this is going to go very badly. I'm also going to bring my big water bottle. I don't have ice or anything in it, but I'm going to bring it just in case I need to fill up this water bottle. Um, cause yeah, so I'm not excited for this, but we're going to do it anyways. I'm going to go see my friends, go see my family of show choir. Persevere. Here we go. Yay. Okay, I also like totally forgot to talk about this, but tomorrow is the one year since our foreign exchange student got hit by the car and died last year. It was the Wednesday before spring break, and it just happens to land on the last day before spring break this year. So, um, her favorite color was red, and so I think 
either the day like that thursday or i don't know at some point we decided to wear red after the whole thing happened and so we're deciding to wear red tomorrow again and i've kind of made up in my head if i go to school i'll of course wear red if i don't i'm still gonna wear my red taylor swift hoodie um i mean i didn't know her but you know it was this weird thing that happened because i was at a dentist appointment i came to school couldn't get into school the parking lot and then had the lacrosse game where we got flowers and i kind of broke down driving the way home um i got two like a blue and green ribbon that every single time i look at it i remember why i have them because we wore these blue and green ribbons for our lacrosse game to you know for her and it's just like this weird thing like part of me is like how the hell has it already been a whole last year but the other half of me is like it's only been a year how the so either way i'm gonna wear red tomorrow um yeah so i i'm not gonna lie i don't want to go to school tomorrow um because of my classes we'll see how i feel tomorrow but the only reason why i'm like really pushing of why i want to go to school tomorrow is because i want to see how many people wear red like dead ass that's my only reason why i want to go to school tomorrow is to see how many people wear red um i'm not gonna be there in the morning so if they do anything it's probably like a moment of silence or something it's probably gonna be in the morning um, they'll probably put flowers out and stuff tomorrow, but only reason why I want to go tomorrow is to, like, be part of this community that, like, came together after this horrible tragedy, but, like, don't want to go to the fucking school. So, yeah, I just remember that. I don't know why I remember that, but I did. What was I doing that? I remember that. I don't know. Anyways, I'm going to get ready to go to school. Peace. Okay guys, welcome back to the vlog. Um, yesterday was April 1st and I swear to God, I went to school, came home, went back to school as I was sitting in my car waiting to go in. I pull up Instagram because, you know, what else do you do? What do I see first thing? Courtney Miller and Shane Top wedding photos and it took me a minute or so to be like oh this is a prank it's April Fool's Day and then I started thinking about it and I'm like all of yesterday and this morning I was like if this is a prank either way I'm happy because it's the best thing to happen either the best prank or like the best Shane and Courtney thing to do. Um, I just turned on my notifications for both Courtney and Shane's Instagrams. Courtney posted like actual wedding photos today, so I, I'm still not, I'm still a little like hesitant to believe it, just a little. So, um. Yes, yeah, still, like I said, still a little hesitant to believe it, but I think it's real. I think Courtney and Jane actually got married on Friday. So, yeah, um, we got a game today. Um, so, yeah, I didn't go to practice yesterday because I was just like wiped from school already feeling 10 times better this morning so yes um I have choir and then I'll come home quickly probably because I'm just gonna wear jeans to school change jeans and then we're gonna wear white jerseys it's just we wear black jerseys to school so that they don't get dirty um and grab my stuff and everything like that when we get back from school um, my sister comes home today from her trip to Texas. Um, so yeah, spring break was good. And yeah, 
I'm so excited. Dude, I, I'm literally like, okay, what are they gonna, is Smosh gonna post like a video today, like talking about it? Cause like the Smosh cast episode yesterday, I haven't watched it, but I know it was Chance and Angela pretending to be Shane and Amanda. And like last night I went on a TikTok binge. So like my, if you go to my Snapchat and my Snapchat story was all Shane and Courtney stuff last night. And then this morning it was a lot of Kelsey stuff because, um, yeah, I'm just like today my TikTok, my TikTok, today my Snapchat is just like full of a shit ton of TikToks and it's probably going to continue because I am definitely, I'm going to give it a bit because it was like probably five minutes ago that Courtney posted more wedding photos um which is so fucking weird to say um but yeah so i'm gonna give it a bit before i go, go back on tiktok but also it's so weird that two people i don't even know getting married and announcing it on april 1st gives me this much joy like i was so giddy last night um, and I'm so giddy this morning. Like, it just makes me so fucking happy, and I don't know why. Um, probably because they both are so amazing and so cute and deserve everything. Anyways, um, that's kind of it. Um, just watching NCIS. Um, at the point where I think this is probably, like, the back door trailer to NCIS, NCIS New Orleans. Um, so yeah. My Snapchat's been, like, blowing up. I don't know what happened, but, like, the beginning of, like, last week, just a bunch of people started adding me on Snapchat, and, like, it just keeps going. And so, like, from someone that used to have, like, zero Snapchat notifications to, like, woke up this morning, had, like, 90, and I'm, like, kind of stressing me the fuck out. Not gonna lie. Um... Yeah, that's kind of it. Dude, I can't. I'm so giddy about this Shane and Courtney thing. It's such a weird thing to be so giddy about, but it... It makes me so happy. Um... But, like, there's probably more I need to say, but I don't remember. I need to do my calendar. It's still fucking February. But I don't want to. Um... We got like two weeks till total chaos breaks out. We got this week, we got next week, and then we got testing week. So I only have to go to school one, I think it's like one or two days. And then Taylor's album comes out that Friday, which I don't come to school. So we can have a little party. And then the week after, I think that's also the weekend of our school's musical, I think. But then the week after is show choir competition, going to Florida, come back, dance concert, um, senior game. Next week after that is, um, what is it? Choir concert. There's something on the 16th that my parents just told me about last night. Oh, um graduation rehearsal and then some point between choir concert and graduation I'm hopefully going to be getting my hair dyed I'm so excited I've been dying like literally dying um yeah that's kind of it it was kind of a chill week I don't remember I don't think I vlogged at all this past week over spring break because my mom was home um so yeah that's kind of it guys any i swear i'm sorry you guys can hear my phone it's from snapchat's notifications like i've had to turn my phone on do not disturb mode for classes because if i don't my phone will just keep doing that and my watch will keep going and it's just kind of very much stressing mm -hmm. me out oh my god um anyways dude honestly this courtney and jane thing is even if it's freaking fake and they're just going hard and I'm being truly gaslit without out of my control 
Um, the fact that they are going this hard on this joke, if it is a joke, I thoroughly enjoy. Oh my god! Sorry, I really am getting pissed off by these notifications. Anyways, I'm gonna keep, I got like 20 minutes till I have to leave to go to school. So I'm gonna not finish this episode, maybe finish this episode. Um, and I will see you guys later. I will keep you guys updated. Actually, I don't, I'm not gonna promise that, but I will try to keep you guys updated on the Shane and Courtney thing. Even though by the time this comes out, it's totally like, you guys, if you really wanted to know, you guys can know. But, yeah. So, I will see you guys all later. Peace out.